nani utaja, utajiuliza kwa nini tumewachagua hawa miongoni mwa mashabiki wa Simba? Kwanza kabisa hawa ni marafiki, ni die fans, uh, lakini pia ni die fan wa Simba vile vile. Na kama unavyoona tuna Lasta hapa lakini tuna jamaa pia ambaye amefuga wenyewe ambao zinakaribia kwenye dreadlock. So ni sio na story sana. Hebu ngoja tutapiga nao story wote kwa, kwa, kwa pamoja then tutajua nini kinaendelea. Bro, mambo vipi? Poa. Ni aje? Safi. Ana umempendeza rafiki yangu. Asante. Eh, Jezi najieleza sina haja kukuuliza. Wewe unaonyesha ni ni, ni mfuatiliaji ama ni shabiki wa Simba, si ndio? Yeah. Unaitwa nani? Jamal. Yes, Jamal, Jamal. Jamal. Jamal tuko na Jamal hapa lakini pia tutakuwa tunapiga story na Lasta hapa. Unaitwa nani boss? Axel. Yes, Axel. Axel, mambo vipi? Po. Ah, uh, umeanza kuitengeneza kui, kui lini utanzia hapo muonekano mfano ni wa amazing na afu kitofauti sana. Umeanza kuitengeneza kuanzia lini? Um, miaka kama tano hivi. Eh yeah, nilikuwa miaka mitano. Okay. So uh, it was your uh, wewe mwenyewe ndio unapendelea una kuwa na dreadlocks au ilikuwa ni influence kutoka kwa parents? Uh, mi, yote. Yote. Eh. Yeah. Okay. Nadhani ukimtizama bwana Axel unaweza kujiuliza kwamba huyu ni raia wa nchi gani? Mimi naomba nisimjibie hilo ye mwenyewe anaweza kujibu wewe. How where do you come from bro? Eh mimi hapa mamaangu mtanzania babangu mspanyola. Kwa huyu bwana ni Spanish nusu lakini pia ni um, Tanzania nusu. Ngoja tuzungumzie game ya leo. Tukianza na bwana Jamal. Unaizungumziaje debi ya leo Yanga na Simba wanakutana ikiwa game iliyopita Yanga walipoteza? Uh, itakuwa ni nzuri kwa sababu ni game ya mwisho mwaka huu. Kwa mwaka sio? Kwa mwaka ya yeah, tunafunga mwaka alafu ndio itakuwa ni derby nzuri kwa sababu these guys someone uh, Yanga anashinda leo kesho Simba anashinda. Kwa hiyo today we're closing the year with the last derby of this is 2021. Na okay. Nadhani kumpenzi uh, mtazamaji wa King Paul TV usipate tabu sana hawa uh, jamaa kwa mfano Jamal yeye ametokea ni Kenya Nairobi. So nadhani unaweza kaiis pia Kiswahili chake lakini tumpe uhuru bwana Jamal anaweza katumia lugha yoyote as long as inaweza kawa ni lugha sahihi kabisa. Uh, bwana Jamal, how the experience between Nairobi and Dar es Salaam Tanzania? I find both of them good because uh, in Tanzania I'm more comfortable also in Kenya but then I I don't know which one to choose actually. I okay. don't have the own experience. The own experience. Yeah. Na tangu umefika una muda gani since you were in Tanzania? Oh, I I live here and also I live in Kenya because my mom is here and my dad is in Kenya, but then I study here. So that's why I'm here. Then on, on holidays I go back Nairobi. Nairobi. Yeah. Okay, so you are studying here in holidays and you are spending your time in holidays in Nairobi. Yeah. And what about you, bro? Eh uh, mimi sometimes kwa kama na holidays mi da summer hivi naenda kuona bibi na babu Spain. Spain na familia nyingine. Okay. Na naishi hapa kwa sababu babangu amependa Tanzania. So kaja kuishi hapa kaza business yake na anaona pazuri hapa. Okay. Kwa hapa ina maana kwa lugha nyepesi uko hapa pamoja na baba na mama wote kwa pamoja. Eh. Yeah. And wewe brother tujazungumzia kidogo una izungumziaje game ya leo kati ya Simba pamoja na Da Young African? Mimi nafikiri opinion yangu Simba inashinda. Simba inashinda. Ndio. Ni kwa opinion yako au kwa experience ya Simba unavyojua? Experience ya Simba. Experience ya Simba. Eh. Yeah. Uh, did you start to following Simba kuanzia kipindi gani? Umeanza kwa shabiki wa Simba kipindi gani? Tangu ukiwa mtoto au tangu ukiwa Spanish? Uh, tangu nivo nivoanza kuangalia mpira wa, wa wa Kibongo hapa. Eh umeanza lini kufuatilia ligi kuu Tanzania bara? Um, kumbuki. Eh okay. Apart from the game today, are you following the music of Tanzania? Muziki wa Tanzania mzee wangu wa Nairobi unasema kule mna genge lakini hapa tuna Bongo Flavor. Umejaribu kuifuatilia Bongo Flavor since umekuwa hapa? Yeah, it's good here because uh, in, in Kenya I think for for me my opinion is only South so and here there is a lot a lot of talent in music more than Kenya in my opinion. Okay so you can tell us that in maana uh, Tanzania kuna competition kubwa zaidi ya music compared na Kenya. I would say that maybe yeah because okay. for me in Kenya the only music I could sit down and listen to is South so and here there's a lot more. Okay. Uh, in Kenya you are listening about South so what about Tanzania? South so uh, in Kenya and South so yeah here I don't know there is Diamond there is Al Kiba all those people they loved in our country also there in, in Nairobi where we live you like everywhere you go you can listen to those guys and you can hear the music and everybody likes them uh I, I can't choose between those two Now you can choose between them I can't I can't So uh when is Shabik you are both with the Diamond Platinums and Ali Saleh like Kiba yeah, because they all have their own f- taste of the way they they sing they just they're different Okay and today uh Ali Kiba yupo Kenya bwana Naivasha 
anakiwasha unadhani mapokezi ya alikiba Kenya naweza kama kubwa kama ambavyo anaheshimika Tanzania yes yes because they like the music of Tanzania yeah so any celebrity who goes there it's a win win Ja Rasta Fly bla zangu pale wewe kwenye muziki wetu nani unampenda zaidi boss ah uh, mi diamond wewe diamond kwa nini diamond na si hawa wasanii wengine boss wako ah uh, mi naona diamond uh, ana kama game changer anafanya kama different kutoka watu wengine ana style nzuri kwangu mimi kwa una, unataka kuniambia kwamba diamond ni rahisi zaidi uh, ku inspire is a new generation kutokana kwamba ana uwezo mkubwa wa kumeka a game change yeah na napenda sauti yake napenda nyimbo zake napenda the meaning kwenye nyimbo yake kila kitu okay. so unaweza kutaja labda nyimbo baadhi ya nyimbo tusikulimi tunaweza kazijua nyingi sana ukaijua moja zote ambazo umependa zaidi kutoka kwa diamond na kwa nini e, kuna kanyaga kunayo moto na kuna e, asijui ndio hizo nazozipenda sana sana hizo. Of course Kanyaga ni bonge moja la ngoma na ilikuwa na maudhui mazuri zaidi kwa sababu alizungumzia uh, tabia nyingi za ambazo si rafiki sana za vijana na mambo mengine yanayoendelea uh, katika nchi. Brother hapa umesema you can choose between uh, Diamond Platinum and Ali Saleh Kiba because wote wana testi sawa ama wana testi nzuri. Unaweza kutuambia nyimbo gani labda za hao wasanii unazozipenda zaidi na kwa nini? Uh, like Uh, I don't know Diamond's Platinum's music I like uh, the one which he sings with people from from um other countries like uh, Rick Ross yeah and he sang with uh, Neo I, I want to marry you and and another one is uh, uh I don't know I forgot and then the one of Alikiba is I don't know I actually don't know but uh, well, I just know that his music is good Yeah, that, uh, okay. I don't listen to Tanzanian music that much but I just know it's good it's better. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So you have been talking about Diamond Platinum and Ali Saleh Kiba. What about da- uh, Harmonize? He's been uh, ni mingoni mwa watu ambao wanafuatiliwa kwa kiasi kikubwa sana kwa kipindi hiki. Don't you see that uh, pia anaweza ka deserve kuwa kwenye listi hiyo ya wasanii wa wini kianza na bro pale? Eh Harmonize anavo Harmonize anaanza kuwasha moto kidogo. Kwa sababu zamani alikuwa anaonekana nilikuwa kama simpendi sana hivi La, <coughs> lakini alivyo alivyo alivotoa song yake make my paper nikapenda sana kwa sababu anaongelea maisha yake alivyokuwa baba yake alikuwa anataka awe mchezaji mpira na yeye ka, ka follow choice yake ana, ana aliyopenda yeye So hii pia unaweza kaona toa advice kwa wazazi kwamba kuna umuhimu mkubwa sana wa kuelewa passion ya mtoto kuliko kumforce kufanya kitu anachokifanya eh yeah. Na nadhani ulipenda hiyo ngoma kwa sababu ya hiyo inspiration peke yake? Ndio na pia haku give up. Hata kila mtu alikuwa na kama alikuwa anamjekea oh hauwezi kufanya, hautafika. Lakini ye kaonyesha watu ambao ye yeah, anaweza kufika. Kafika, uh, sema ambao ipo sasa hivi. Na nafikia anaendelea vizuri. Okay, thank you very much. Bro, what about harmonize kwa upande wako wewe? I don't know much about his music but i know that before he um, he went to this epic bongo star search and then yes. they didn't accept him yes yes and then they they told him he couldn't make it in music yes. uh, and and today he's hitting and he's famous and he used to be uh, close friends with diamond i think yeah he was under the label wcb before yeah but then he left and then now he's competing with him and and stuff like that yeah but then i don't follow up in the in their drama But I, I, I'm just I'm not you're not interested with that drama. Yeah 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 but I just like the music when they remove music I like it. Yeah and I like the uh, your opinion because you you have been knowing harmonize since he was struggling in epic bongo stage. So congratulations for that. Wengi wanakuwa wanafuatilia na wanawehuka na hizi beef lakini huwa hawajui history za wasanii. Chochote labda ambacho mnaweza mkawaambia uh, fans wa Simba ambao wako nyumbani wajabatika kuja kucheck game leo lakini pia na wa ndugu wa Yanga. Uh, They should watch the game in the TV if they they didn't get the experience to be in the stadium and watch the game. They, but they should also enjoy it in, at homes with their families. Okay. Any words for your friends in Nairobi? Um they should also watch the game I guess. I don't know. You can mention if you can. Yeah, they should also watch the game. Uh <laughs> I don't know if they they they're interested in watching the games yeah, but I know mostly they're mostly interested in the music here. Yeah. 
Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. And you bro anyway, uh, neno lako la mwisho kwa rafiki zako, mashabiki wa Simba, rafiki zako walioko uh, uh, uko Hispaniola, uh, eh? Wa Spanish wenzio pia ambao umewahi kuwa nao since ukienda uh, sama ukienda kutoa salamu. Um, angalia ni mpira wa Tanzania. Ni mzuri sana. Okay. Na pia mziki wetu pia waangalieni na njo utuone hapa. Okay. Asante sana mzee. Haya. Ongea okay, lakini dreadlocks pia zimerudi uh, zimekupendeza mno. Asante. Okay, thank you for your time. Thank you very much.